Hi guys, Legend of Old 101 here once again. Just talking about Tessa Blanchard. This topic. Has Tessa Blanchard got too much heat? So, for me, Tessa Blanchard is the best wrestler, female wrestler on the planet. There is no contest. Tessa Blanchard is number one. Let's get that straight right now. She's number one. But at the same time, it's tough because I don't know if companies are holding back or if she's holding back on taking an offer from a company. Because she did her best work in Impact. No doubt. Impact, she was literally the top draw there. Um... But you had all these allegations, the racism allegations, the holding the title hostage allegations. Um, I don't think that ever got cleared up. She wouldn't have come back to give the belt back. Um, just stuff like that. And the uh, thing with Tessa Blanche is very passionate, very strong. And I'm like, okay. That's what you need the pro wrestling. You need that. That steel, that's what she has. She's got that steel, she's got that Blanchard mentality, you know, that steel. But, same time, with Tessa Blanchard, you've got to take the rough and the smooth with her, you know what I'm saying? Because she can have outbursts, she can just like go off, you know what I'm saying? She can just, she's just like, her mind's gone, you know what I'm saying? She just does her own thing. But, it's a thing with Tessa Blanchard, you've got to know how to handle people like that, you know what I'm saying? It's, I don't know. It's, AEW for some reason um, her dad's there I'm surprised she hasn't gone there yet because I think she's kind of aware of her options and I do not know where she's going to end up to be honest it's, it's a toss of the coin it's a flip at this point I don't know where she's going this this is it's tough I can't I can't even guess at where she's going to go I don't know I, don't, I can't guess NXT AEW you know what I'm saying I, I don't know I do not know but um, wherever she does go, they're going to have a great talent. Number one female wrestler on, on planet Earth. She's number one. As I said before, they're going to have the best woman wrestler. Um, I say, I say ever. Ever. She's the best woman wrestler in history. I'm, I'm, I'm saying it now. I'm, I'm saying it now. Tessa Blanchard is the best woman wrestler in history. I'm saying that right now. And I've seen a lot of wrestling in my time. I've been around a long time. So... Yeah, best woman wrestler in history. Then we get all the talent. You know what I'm saying? The speed, the power, you know what I'm saying? The technical prowess, the charisma, the mic work. She has everything. She's the she's the flipping out what they what they call it, five tool player. She's everything, man. She has the mic work. As I said before. Um, the skill. You know what I'm saying? She has the charisma. She has the look, my gosh. Bruh. Bruh, she has the presentation. Bruh, she has it all. She has it all. She has it all. But um, but there is that shadow that constantly falls around nowadays. You know, she has that shadow. Ever since that um, those allegations came out, that shadow's just been hanging over her. Ever since what happened to Impact, those. And I think <sighs> she could go to AEW and build up that division to what it needs to be. Like when she came to Impact, just build it up, just literally they like, revolve around that but they had good wrestlers anyways impact all that good wrestling wrestlers regardless for she had the battle for a long time impact has always had good um, wrestlers in tna days but nxt they have a ton of them <laughs> nxt a ton of women wrestlers but you got tire going over there now my gosh it's gonna have, nxt division gonna be stacked but aew they need tessa blanchard that's what i say they need Tessa Blanchard. So it's all it's all in her court at this point, and and some of it isn't. It's 50 50 Some of it is her decision, and the same it's equally not her decision because of stuff that surrounds her. You know, saying she's she's a heat magnet. That's just, let's just get it straight right now. She's a heat magnet. So I don't know if AEW wants that kind of thing because a lot of women, um, with the rest is there. Probably gonna have heat with her. You know what I'm saying? Backstage. And I don't know if. Tony Khan wants that because Sammy Guevara's they've already got enough heat as it is. Sammy Guevara, he's a heat magnet himself. 
I don't know if they want two heat magnets on the roster. They don't want that kind of publicity. Cause they, you can tell they're kind of, yeah, I'm trying to stay out the that, that kind of business, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to keep it, their head, their nose is clean, you know? So, yes, it's a weird one. It's a weird one. And personally, if, you, if you're asking me, I'd want, him to, I want her to go in AEW. Um, just to help build that vision, be, be be the face, you know what I'm saying? Help out, get the face, the the Thunder Roses, you know, the Sheeters of the world, the Statlanders. Oh my gosh, that's a great match. Um, yeah, Layla Hirsch. I think that'd be a good match. Well. Layla Hirsch. Ooh, ooh, Layla Hirsh was Tessa Blanche. Ooh, Layla Hirsch. She's 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 slowly getting better, and I think that'd be a good match. But yeah. Um, yeah, I say AEW for me, but wherever she goes, hey, I want the best for Tessa Blanchard. I'm a massive fan of Tessa Blanchard. Massive. I don't feel she's a racist. I don't not feel she's one, but a lot of people do. But yeah, I want Tessa Blanchard to, to do well and go where she's needed the most and wanted. So hopefully Tony Khan gives her a contract. I want her to go there. It all depends on the people in the back, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes it's because Tony Khan's the people guy, you know what I'm saying? He wants, you know, doesn't want too much like heat back there, you know? There's too much unrest backstage. So, I want to know you guys think in the uh, comment section down below. Tell me you guys think about where do you think Tesh Blanchard is going to go? Um, do you think it's too much heat for your either company to take her on? Do you think she put herself in a hole because of all the allegations and stuff that she's done in the past? I don't know. I don't know. But um, as I said before, she is the number one women's wrestler in history for me. I, I, I double down now in history. In history, she's the best women's wrestler in history, bro. Bar none. Not even close. No one else right now. Just, the way she's silky smooth in that ring, my God. Ooh, Serena deep. Ooh, Serena. Ooh, she's close, but she doesn't have the charisma of a Tessa Blanchard. So that's what's holding her back. So, Serena, do you have the charisma? Oh, my baby. I'll be like, okay, okay. But nah, Tessa Blanchard, yeah. Yeah. Tessa Blanchard is the best woman's dress in history. So, yeah. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. If you want to get to me, if you want to talk about Tessa Blanchard or anything, any other issues or topics, you know. Thumbs this video up, share the video, subscribe to the channel, become part of Lexi, become part of the movement, and press that notification bell, and I'll be in your inbox the whole day, every day. And remember to always stay safe wherever you are, out in these streets. It's the Legend of All 101 signing out.